What's up YouTube? This is Christopher Mavros and today I'm going to show you how to create an awesome quiz in Joomla 4 using Simple Quiz. So Simple Quiz is a component so you can find it under the menu components, Simple Quiz and it's got three, three options, quizzes, questions and results. Here in quizzes we've got the empty quiz table where we can create our quizzes. So let's click to new and uh, this is the quiz edit page. We'll see some of these options in this video and I'll walk you through all the options in another video. So first of all we need to specify what quiz is this? Meaning is this a quiz where the user can answer a few questions and a percentage is calculated? then this is a quiz, the amount of, of correct answers over uh, the total questions. If you want a survey, you can simply select survey, no calculation of results, and you simply get what the user selects in its question. A score quiz is a type of quiz where you can select your own scores for each answer in each question. This meaning that you can create your own psychology tests, you can assign custom scores depending on the answer, you can create IQ tests and cr also create different scores depending on the answer of the, of the user, meaning that you can also create tests to check out wi which are the interests of the user, like uh, if they like music or arts or science. I'll show you through this in another video about questions. Finally, we've got the options, uh, the option to create a test to compare with friends' answers. A user takes the quiz and then sends a link to his friends in order to compare their answers and see how well they know each other. So for now, we'll select quiz and let's write here my first quiz. This is the quiz name. Uh, it's visible to the user. And we've got a fail percent. Since this is a quiz, you can set the amount of the, the percentage of, of correct questions above which you want the user to succeed in this quiz. Here you can select a quiz image. You can set a nice image of those found in Joomla. Not some notes for the administrator. And now we've come to who can see this quiz whether it, it's published or not, whether or not you require users to be registered or not to see this quiz. And also you can turn this quiz into a contest. How? You set a specific date and time for the start and end of this quiz of publication. And then when the quiz is finally uh, unpublished, it's finished, it's a finished contest, the users can see the results and uh, which one achieved the best amount of uh, questions, of correct answers. Now, here's the option, uh, here are some options on how this quiz is played. You can select whether or not to show questions in a random order, not the one that you create them in. And if you select that, you can also select how many of the questions you create are shown each time. For example, let's say you have 10 questions, you can select whether or not to show them all or just a small amount of them, for example, three out of 10. And this time the user, every time the, the user accesses the, the quiz, they get a different uh, set of questions. You can also set this quiz to be timed you can set an amount of time and questions, for example, 60 uh, seconds uh, that the, the quiz uh, is available to the user. And also you can set a playing limit, whether or not uh, it's uh, unlimited or limited, for example, to once per day, per week, or per month, etc. Now, this final set of options here allows you to uh, make it easier for the user or not to maintain their answers. For example, if you want the, the test to be available through different questions, uh, for example, uh, using a module, a pop-up or something like that, you can allow them to 
maintain their answers as they navigate through your site. Or if you don't want your user to do that, for example, if you want them to lose their answers and uh, every time they take the quiz, you can set this to no. And this is the same thing about the user details, for example, their name and their emails, etc. So we'll see the rest of the tabs in another video. I'm just going to cl click save and close and uh, we'll get a congratulations. We've made our first quiz. Let's check out the front end. This is an empty website. This was the quiz list before. And now here's the list of our amazing quizzes. If you click on it, either here or start now, you get the error that no questions are found. So we've got to add some questions to it. We'll do that on the next video for the moment. Thank you for watching. You can feel free to comment, to uh, like the video or subscribe. And feel free to check out our other extensions at marvelouschristophers.com. Thank you for watching.